catching cheaters and proud of it. Ow, I'm sorry. It's your home for War of the Roses on Mojo in the Morning. Gavin thinks that his wife is cheating with a coworker. Gavin? Hey. So you guys have having like some problems at home right now? Yeah, kind of. And are you guys currently separated or are you together? Uh, no, we're we're together. I mean, uh, we're not talking right now um, just because of a fight we just had. But uh, yeah, we're, to, we're together. There has been an issue as far as finances are concerned, and you think that she's doing something that is not supposed to be done by a married woman. You think she's cheating and you notice something financially, is that right? What is it? What's going on? Uh, so we've been saving up to, to buy a house, um, putting money into the same bank account. Um, but she hasn't been putting money uh, into the account for like months now. And yeah, like her excuse is, um, you know, she's overspending and she's saying she's in a weird place mentally. But I don't, I don't, I don't know if I believe that. Do you know what she's, like, overspending on? Is it, like, emotional buying, or is it things that you guys need? Well, uh, I got one of her bank statements in the mail the other day, and it said it's been on um, money uh, uh, money on food, Ubers, Airbnb. Why would she be airbnb I can only think to get out of the house and find time with someone else. And th- that's weird because she lives at your house, right? She's still living with you? Yes. She, yeah, she still lives here. But if she's spending time at an Airbnb, then like I, I'm not aware of that. And I doubt she's there by herself. And when you say you guys are, are fighting or you got in a fight, are the fights only about money or are they about other things? They start with money, um, but they sometimes can branch out into other things. I'm a like general trust and prioritizing uh, like each other. You specifically think that there's some guy that she's working with that you're worried that they're a little too close. Why is that yeah. relationship something you're worried about? Yeah, there's this guy on our team at work, um, and I'm just worried because like. They're texting a lot, Um, and I don't know if it's always him, but um, sometimes she'll just be on her phone texting somebody for a while, and I I can see that, like, the the smile, like, she's trying to hide a smile on her face. So, So, yeah. So you can sense that she enjoys doing this? Yeah. We're going to call her and her coworker together to see what they sound like when they're talking to each other and not knowing that others are listening in it's a mojo in the morning three-way call war of the roses can you mute your phone so that they don't get suspicious that somebody else is on the phone yeah all right do that and uh then i'll start dialing Did she email you back about Thursday? Or do I have to get on her? Uh, yeah, if you can get on her about that. I haven't gotten it yet. <sighs> yeah, that's fine. I'm just, she's on my last nerve and, like, <laughs> has me so worked up. He's, like, picking fights with me and, like, is going to be <laughs> the last straw if she doesn't I, get Oh, my God. Her. I know. Oh my I know. <laughs> I'm so annoyed. Sorry, but. I know. Geez. Like just, yeah. <laughs> I, I need to get I, out yeah. of the house for like a night. <laughs> like I'm gonna, I'm gonna murder somebody, and then I'm gonna go to jail. <laughs> like, Don't do that. It's Don't not do that. Good. It's, I know. It's not worth it. Um, I know. I just, I feel like I need to get out of my house. <laughs> like, 
Uh, I know. Can you to, like, make well, I mean, you know, you know, the invitation's open. If you want to stay at my place, yeah. you're, you're welcome to come over. I mean, you I know, could just I know you guys are. Because I pass out yeah. in the place all the time, you know. Because <laughs> I can't stay awake through a whole movie to save my life. Um, no, you can't. Uh huh. <laughs> well, we don't just have to watch, watch movies. movies together. What? Yeah, you can hang out and do whatever. I'll do whatever. <laughs> Why the f are you watching movies together? Why the f are we watching movies together? I mean, yeah, I guess we don't have to watch a movie. No. Celas? Why are you f hanging out at his house? What? Celas? Yeah. Celas? I don't know. I don't know if you recognize the voice that is just talking to you. That voice that was just talking to you is your husband. This is the Mojo in the Morning Show. What? This is the Mojo. What's going on? This is the Mojo in the Morning Show, and your husband was wondering what was going on between you and a coworker, and just got a chance to hear it. Kevin, did you know that these guys were going over to each other's homes and doing this? No. So this has never been something that you've ever known that they hang out with each other after work or while work's going on? No, nothing like that. Do you know him? Like, have you met him before? Just once uh, we invited people from her work over. It uh, just seemed normal, though. And you've never suspected that she has ever had a relationship with anybody else but him, though, with just the way that she's texting? Just him. At this point, I don't know. That, uh, it seems like they're way closer than, uh, than you probably even suspected, especially with her talking about falling asleep. I mean, you, you don't just fall asleep at somebody's house if you're just there for a few moments, you know what I mean? Yeah. All right, hang on one second. This is the home of War of the Roses. I absolutely love it. Mojo in the morning.